Hey everybody, happy Friday, the 26th of January. My goodness, can you believe it? Next week, next Thursday is already the first, uh, less than a week away. I hope you had a great Friday. I had a great day at the office with my team, doing lots of fun things with technology. And then tonight with a buddy of mine, went up and had uh, this little place called the Blue Goose Tavern. They have a fantastic 16 ounce New York strip, a side of bacon, two scrambled eggs. I was still hungry and I asked for four more scrambled eggs. So I had six scrambled eggs. Yeah, total, but it was great. I think that was, I went into Chronometer, the app, and I think it was around 145 um, gra uh, grams of protein and then around 1400 calories. And then if I remember correctly, it was like around 65 percent fat ratio. I can't remember exactly, but somewhere in there. I knew it was right around 145 um, grams of protein. Um, some say that's too low. I say eat till you're full. And that's all I've been doing, right? Um, I had a question from someone and it was great. You know, these products have been out a long time, but they say, hey, Joel, what do you do, um, you know, for belts? You know, have you found it issue, uh, difficult just to keep getting new belts? Do they break? Do they do this or that? Whatever the case may be. Well, I found the perfect belt. I really did. And I've tried many knockoffs over the years, and I found finally found the true belt. I use a slide belt. And what this is, it's a ratcheted system where there's this little piece here in the buckle that lifts up to release the uh, the little notched mechanism on the back side of the belt right there are the teeth, super deep, solid. It's just great, very robust. A lot of the belts, us bigger guys, when I was 322, it would strip out, right? I'd tighten it up and it would strip out. This has never stripped out. I've had this for a year and a half. and I bought three of them. I have... Um, kind of a dark brown, a really lighter tan, and different colored buckles. And then I bought this utility one. It's kind of a rubberized material. And then uh, this buckle here actually has a flip up knife and all this crazy stuff in it. It's too bulky actually. I don't you even use it. But if I'm ever stuck out in the woods and I have nothing, I got a knife. <laughs> what am I gonna do with that? Anyway, I'm a boy. I bought the, the utility belt. So. The cool thing is with this is that, you know, if you want to sit down and loosen up your trousers, first of all, you just loosen up this little uh, notch here, get that in, right in there, you just slide it in. Super easy. And then you're good to go. And then if you want to sit down, relax and have dinner, then you just lift this up. And I'm going to just stick my finger in there, but you can see, you just pull it out a little bit. All right, I'm gonna relax, sit down. And then when you wanna get up, right back, your trousers are held up and you go off about your way. No more of those opening your belt, flipping the belt open, trying to find the next belt hole and then uh, and getting it back over, lifting up your belly, up your shirt. It's embarrassing, you know? Plus it looks creepy. You take your belt and you undo your belt and then try and tighten it up. This is so inconspicuous. It's under your shirt if you uh, wear an untucked shirt or um, if you don't, it's just easy. You just, there you go, I just tighten my belt. Very, very, very simple. And it really works great for bigger fellas like myself, it was 322. And uh, again, I kept stripping other belts out. Slide belt, these are the guys right here. And you reach out in there, and you, if you get a couple of products, you're probably going to discount. Again, this is not my affiliate link. Just find them online. Get the best deal you can. I just want to let you know about them. This is a community where we can help each other out. But here's the best part about this belt. If you want to make this thing shorter, all you do is on the back side, there are two set screws. You take those out. They have a very fine point at the tip that dig in so this won't slide. On the other side, there's this little latch here that you have to just get a small screwdriver under there because it is tight, very compressed. So this compression fit also has teeth on it. So you pop this out after you've taken these out and this whole thing just boop, drops open. So then 
it's got a flat cut right here. So you just bring the belt down. If you want to cut off six inches, it's fine. And then make sure it's nice and flat and then slide it right back up into here. You're gonna then press this closed again for a nice compression, flip this around and take your two small Allen wrenches or uh, Allen screws and put those in and just tighten them down good and snug. I have mine fairly, fairly flush. <laughs> it's not really focusing, sorry. But anyway, uh, and, and it just works great. And they don't back out. You don't have to worry about that. Um, I've had a lot of different belts that I've tried to do this that were knockoffs, that these things would back out and one would fall out and you'll lose it. And it's kind of a specialty set screw. So then you had to call the ca crazy slide belt. These guys just figured it all out. So there you go. Again, find it wherever you can get the best deal. I just recommend this brand because I've had them for a year and a half and they just work great. So just a little more about me. Boy, it's just, it's nonstop, isn't it? <laughs> All right, God bless you guys. Have a great night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.